Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Hassan. Today we are going to be making a very simple bitter gourd recipe. So bitter gourd is actually widely available in Asia and South Africa and some Caribbean. And according to the name, it is bitter. So um, very difficult to eat without a lot of seasoning. Um, some people put a salad topping raw. It, it, takes, um, it takes a very unique uh, taste uh, or palate to eat. Um, but it does have a lot of health benefits. So today, let's go ahead and start and give it a little twist. And I want to start off with uh, trimming the bitter gourd. And I usually take off the very tip of it on the front and the back side. We don't need all this right here. And for this, uh, since we'll be making this in the air fryer, we want to make it really thin slices. So that way it cooks quick and thorough. So as you cut it, you're going to cut through some seeds inside. And it is optional for you to either take the seeds out or leave them in there. Uh, there's no harm in leaving them in there. Uh, this adds more to the texture. So these these will be these will turn out somewhat like a uh, almost like uh, dried chips. All right, so we've got this cut, and we'll just add them to our bowl here. So as you can see, some of these have the seed, and you could easily pop them out, and you could you know you could discard the seed. Uh, so we'll do some with and some without it. Hey everyone, welcome back. We have our uh, bitter gourd, bitter melon that we prepared earlier in our uh, session. We have some with the core, some without the core. And as far as ingredients, we have about approximately five medium pieces of bitter gourd, bitter melon. We have one and a half tablespoon of gram flour, one tablespoon of rice flour, one teaspoon of red chili powder, one teaspoon of turmeric powder, a half a teaspoon of garam masala, we have one teaspoon of coriander powder, one teaspoon of chaat masala, two tablespoons of oil. And you can add salt to taste. Okay, let's go ahead and get these things all mixed together. I have already placed our cut bitter gourd into a bigger bowl, so it's easier to mix. And let's go ahead and add our ingredients to this. We'll start with the rice flour. Then we have our gram flour, our mix of spices, and lastly we'll put some oil in here. Okay, let's give it a good mix here. Want to make sure that we get everything from the bottom the flour goes to the bottom and uh, you want to make sure that everything is get, gets coated pretty good you may want to also kind of you know, toss it a bit here to so get that all the bottom flour back up on top and all the spices evenly all right so we'll go ahead and get our, our air fryer ready for the next step so let's go ahead and uh, load our air fryer up with this and uh, I'll be using the Ninja air fryer which does not require any preheat. So what we're going to do is let's go ahead and load up our pan with the air fryer with our bitter gourd chips. And you want to try to get them in a single layer so they uh, you know, cook thoroughly and uh, crispy. The marinade has stuck onto these pretty good, so they should turn out to be uh, really, really tasty. Okay, so we've got a single layer of it. And let's go ahead and set our air fryer to, we're gonna set the air fryer setting. Uh, the temperature will be at 350 and the time is 20 minutes. All right, see you shortly. Okay, we're down to the last five seconds. And let's see how these things turned out. All right, looks like very well done here.
Definitely crispy. As you can see, very well coated and seasoned. The advantage of doing this in an air fryer is that you're really minimizing the the oil and also vinegar does have good health uh, benefits so uh, combined it becomes a very healthy snack all right we'll give us a taste and see how it tastes definitely very well done all right so thanks for watching and please like and subscribe Leave some comments and if you've tried this, let me know how it turns out for you.